Hello, this is Sunny. Welcome back. In this video, I will talk about Adam, the worst husband ever. God told Adam not to eat the forbidden fruit. However, when his wife was attempted by the Satan, Adam didn't do anything to stand up for his wife, nor rebuke the Satan. Instead, he kept silent and played dumb the whole time. The first rule of leadership: everything was his fault. Did he know the fruit might be poison, or did he try to poison his wife on purpose? Adam showed his lousy character when God investigated the fruit incident. Here was his excuse: "The woman you put here with me, she gave me some fruit from the tree, and I ate it." Listen carefully. Adam blamed his wife first. She did it, not me, and she gave me the fruit with love and tenderness. My head was cloudy and heavy. I was totally confused. Plus, I was drunk, too much grape wine. Not only he blamed Eve, but also he blamed God. Dear Heavenly Father, first, I didn't ask for wife. Food is abandoned, abundant here in my garden. I can make fruit salad and apple pie on my own. I don't need a woman in my kitchen cooking and nagging. But you put the woman here with me while I was sleeping. It hurt badly when you did that. For your information, and you arranged my marriage without asking me if I dated someone else. She was not that good-looking, and she was、uh, fat, and she also had a drinking problem. That's okay, but I hate her most when she was backseat driving. Well, I don't need to buy a GPS. I think. At this point, I guess that God must wonder why He didn't stop creation after creating monkeys and dinosaurs. I would totally understand if Eve had kicked his butt and taken all apples with her as alimony and moved to New York City, the Big Apple. Adam might not be the first singer, sing singer, not a singer, but he was the worst husband ever.